deformed sailor who would eat spinach laced with PCP and go beat up everyone he thought was hitting on his girlfriend? Maybe that's not how you remember him, but that seems to be how Hollywood makeup artist Rick Baker does. With a MakerBot Replicator 2, the seven-time Oscar-winning artist has masterfully created a realistic portrayal of Popeye the Sailor Man. Baker began his makeup career by dyeing his mother's pie crust and molding prosthetic pieces. But before long, he became known as a makeup legend behind the films like Star Wars Episode IV. The artist came into 3D printing almost by accident as he bought the 3D printer as a means of donation to Big Brothers Big Sisters. He had thought of the machine as more of a toy that he could probably print up custom palettes to put makeup in. A new 3D printer has a bit of a learning curve and it took him a few weeks to get the knacks of his replicator, he admits. In no time, Baker was able to apply his expert 3D modeling skills to his newly mastered tool. About seven years ago, Baker 3D modeled a beautifully rendered bust of the detailed Popeye that became so popular that according to the artist, people have gotten tattoos of it. It brings the model into the physical world by printing it at about four inches in height and applies many layers of paint with Baker saying the final Popeye printed has 20 different glazes on it. The hat on Popeye's head is a separate print in which real threads was melted into the MakerBot's warm gray PLA filament. There's a lesson to take away from Rick's Popeye story. If you're having trouble with your own prints, don't worry, you're not the only one. Even Hollywood legends struggle with their 3D printers. But with time and a lot of trial and error, you can create something so beautiful with really great resolution.